Welcome to another edition of Swim Easy Speed. Today we're going to look at why do you swim off course? And a hint, it doesn't have anything to do with your sighting. So being able to hold a straight line in open water swimming has very little to do with your ability to see. Um, you really, what you need to have is a very, very balanced stroke. And that means balance kind of not only from side to side, but the amount that you're pulling. Because what you want to think about is, when you're in a canoe, if you paddle harder to one side versus another, yeah, you're not going to hold a straight line. And just because you can see something or see a landmark in the distance, um, that's not going to help you hold that straight line. So here's some of the data that I've gotten from the sensors. So you can see, you know, the difference between these are all age group triathletes here. And if you look up in those corners, the right and left corner, you can see kind of that um, the amount of power they're generating. Now, these are pro triathletes. Even they are unbalanced. So 2.3, 1.98, but they start to get a little bit better. 1.95, 2.0. That's what you're really looking for is this really, really balanced stroke where you're pulling equally on each side. And then, you know, when you sight, you can just then make small corrections if you go off course. But for the most part, if you are balanced in your stroke, so if you're balanced on how much you're rotating from side to side, if you're balanced kind of front to back, um, where you're not creating a lot of drag and you're long on the water with your core engaged, these are all things that are going to lead to your ability to hold a straight line in open water and make it as efficient as possible. So these were actually the two uh, leaders in the 5K from the Snapping Tortuga um, this past weekend. And you can see, you know, they held a straight line. Um, they, I think they only swam basically over the 5k about a hundred meters longer than the course, um, which is about as good as you're going to get. So if you're looking for a drill to do, to kind of start this off and see kind of, Hey, one side, which one side is pulling harder than the other, just do a little bit of a one arm drill and basically just do a 25 with your right arm, then a 25 with your left arm and see how they feel. So as always, thank you for tuning in. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. And uh, I hope to see you in the pool soon.